Hi, in this recording I'm just going to talk you through the BMS191 Smart Sparrow lessons. Right, from the home of screen we can just click on the Smart Sparrow Tutorials tab and this takes us to the link that would, would uh, to launch the lessons. Now I just want to mention that at the moment we have chem lessons for chemistry, cells, nervous system and the muscular system topics and as uh, the semester progresses I'll add more um, systems to the list here so uh, you'll, you'll see once when there's more lessons available. Um, now these lessons work best if you use the web browser Google Chrome to access the lessons. Um, Firefox and Microsoft Edge and Safari they all work sometimes but Chrome seems to consistently work with the least problems so if you have any problems accessing the lessons please close your browser open up Google Chrome and access the and go to your i2 site through Google, Google Chrome and if you continue to have problems please email me klinden at csu.edu.au okay so let's launch the lessons we just click on the, the link and it takes us to the smart sparrow learn space which is like an index page that allows us to access each of the lessons so here we can see this is chemistry the cell, the nervous system, the muscular system. As more lessons appear, they'll appear down here on the left hand side. Um, let's start by clicking on the chemistry lesson. So the chemistry lesson has been designed to cover the whole chemistry topic for BMS 191 um, and you can work through it at your own pace. Uh, and if you type in your name and select your course at the beginning of the lesson, you'll then receive um, course specific th feedback throughout. So for example, if you're a nursing student, um, then throughout the lesson you'll be provided with information as to why understanding these aspects of chemistry are important to studying nursing. Um, now within the lesson that's broken up into three sections, now if you've studied chemistry before you might be really confident about the atom, so you might skip that section and start with chemical bonds, for example. Uh, if you haven't studied chemistry before, I really recommend you do start with part one, the mighty atom. Now throughout each of the sections, we have a progress bar, so you can see how far through you are the lesson. Um, and we'll have a mixture of information, and some of this appears in your lecture notes, and some is different. Uh, and you'll then have the option to, you'll have a small amount of information, and then you'll have the option to review the structure of the atom, or to, to continue with the content for that section, or to skip to the questions if you're feeling confident. If it's the first time working through the, the material, we recommend that you work through the content. Um, and But if you are, are familiar with the, con the content, maybe it's the second time you've worked through the lesson, then you can skip to the questions. Um, and the questions are a mixture of multiple choice questions and uh, drag and dropping the answer and type in the answer. So we've got quite a few different questions and then after you finish the questions you'll then move on to the, the next part of part one um, and, and and so it can take up to about 30 minutes to attempt each part of the lesson so they're quite long but you don't have to do it all in one sitting if anything we actually recommend that you don't so once you have um, uh, completed part of the lesson, I'll just move this, my screen's not showing you, there's a, a option at the top to go back to the learn space, so if we click there then we just return to the learn space and you could attempt questions on another system if you like, or otherwise you can just close the window. And once you open the window again you'll be, uh, so when you access the lessons again next through your i2 site, you'll be able to return back to the exact same place within the lesson that you were last accessing it. So don't don't worry about closing the lessons at all. Alright, we hope that you enjoy the Smart Sparrow lessons. There will be um, an opportunity to provide us with feedback. We'll um, uh, hand out a survey later through the semester. Um, and uh, yeah, and we really appreciate your feedback. In the meantime, if you had to have some feedback, feel free to email me, Kelly Linden. So that's klinden at csu.edu.au. Great. Thank you very much and good luck with the subject.